still pretty surreal, I think, for the group. Um, massively proud to begin with for the squad to back up what we did last year. Obviously beating the Kiwis, that was something that certainly myself, Katie and Whitey, we, we were very aware that we'd never beat them at any level before, so we had to take that off the list. So to take that off the list yesterday was was awesome, especially in the manner, 21-0 down. Um, but then to go on and obviously beat the US in that final against the English, yeah, I don't think uh, yeah, it couldn't have written that script. Well, we knew we'd get opportunities against them. We know that we're one of the fittest teams in the circuit because we do we do train really, really hard uh, in terms of the anaerobic side with, with Nick Lumley. Um, so we knew we'd get our opportunities later on in the game. And we've also got a great bench, so we said just, just keep on plugging away, doing the things we know work well, and our chances will come, and they did come. And they came pretty quick in the last sort of minute. And once again, Whitey's composure to take that little short kick. No, no, it doesn't get any better than that. Um, and I think, as I said, with boys, the English boys are a lot of our mates as well, you know. Uh, and we've got masses of respect for them because they had a brilliant tournament. Dan Norton especially had a cracking tournament, but... We've just got so much belief in, in this squad. Obviously, last year we beat them in the quarterfinal 17 0. The year before, we beat them for the first time in 31 years at Twickenham. And uh, we weren't going to let them get away with it this year again. So it was nice to come away with that, that cup. <laughs>